honestly, we feel very excited. Uh, it just goes to show that preparation really means everything. We really stood out here and we grinded, we put a whole bunch of work in, and to see that really pay off means a lot to me, honestly. And I'm sure it means a lot to the team, too. We've been practicing for this competition uh, maybe since December, but mostly since January. Um, so we pulled practice problems from old competitions um, and we actually physically built the courses. You can see all around the floor over here, we've built courses and they actually ran it. Um, we looked at code, uh, you know, we would try one thing and it wouldn't work, so they would debug it and try to fix it. Running those practice problems really helped us prepare kind of for anything because they don't actually tell us what the problems are until we get there that day. Honestly, it's not always good days with each person and when pressure builds sometimes you can get more heated in the moment you have to learn that collaboration is everything you have to respect everyone and essentially know that your part matters as well it's a group project a collective if you will we didn't really assign roles but when we really got into the competition it kind of became clear who was doing what like tristan one of the members um, he would run the robot over to the playing field and he would have it and then we also had two or three clear people working on one code at a time we did win, so that means that all the work we put into it has finally come together. What you don't see at practice here today is we really have more like 15 people that are in robotics team, robotics club, however you want to call it. Um, but we are really wanting to ramp up recruiting for next year, pulling in new ninth graders and things like that, especially from Eastwood. Eastwood placed in the competition. They killed it, so definitely looking to pull some of them. And then anybody else who hasn't had the chance to sign up and wants to sign up in the future.